Well, I think in Europe, people actually use less plastic bags. Like, people actually have, like, bags for shopping, to go with shopping. But then in Africa, like, all the shops just provide plastic bags, and people are not educated enough to know that, you know, it's not safe to use plastic bags, that it's better that you just buy one bag which you can use for a long time. So I think that's the major difference between Africa and Europe with the plastic bag. I think what they should do mostly in shops, they should not provide plastic bags, but at least paper bags or, you know, like educate people more and just tell them like it's better you just use like normal bags instead of plastic bags. Like for instance in Zanzibar, like they banned plastic bags, I think, and now they just use like paper bags. Like in shops, you won't be able to find plastic bags or they won't even sell you plastic bags. In Arusha, we went to this um, community thing in school and went to like this place, like a school, but then it was close to a dumpster, like where they throw everything. And like literally there was plastic bags everywhere, like on trees, it looked like trees were just growing plastic bags and houses had like plastic bags over them. And you can see kids actually like, you know, they use this as like games to play with like plastic bags and everything. And I think it looked really nasty. It didn't look beautiful at all. So I think if we just stop using them, this would not happen. Because I think if everyone used it in the future, this is what would look like, like plastic bags everywhere. And it's just not pretty. I think in schools they should actually take it more serious, like teachers should actually, you know, teach the kids to actually not use plastic bags, because you don't find this in school where they have, like, classes about recycling or, you know, plastic bags and the effects, so I think in school they should actually, like, make teachers get involved or just tell teachers to actually take, like, you know, let the kids know every day, like, this is a problem, like, kids, please don't use this and stuff. Because when I went to Belgium in ISB and um, went to grade two class, and their teacher is part of um, the JJI um, Institute in Belgium, and, like, she was teaching the kids, like, about plastic bags and um, recycling, and they actually knew what, like, where to put the recycle, like, I mean, stuff which can be recycled and not to use plastic bags. And they just, like, you know, there were, like, three or four, five, and they already knew this. And they're like, but people don't listen to us when we tell them. So, I mean, if teachers actually did this every day, like, in school and taught them and just, you know, kept telling the children, like, I mean, the kid, this is, you know, this is not right, then I think it would actually change their way of thinking because teachers have actually a major impact on children because they teach them so